Hello! This is the Grief Time Channel. Today we're going to tell you which celebrities have passed away. Videos are published every day. Subscribe and press the bell. Or an American country music singer-songwriter. After a knee injury at Southwest Texas State University ended a potential football career, Charlie Robeson came to Austin, Texas in the late 1980s and had stints in the bands Chaparral, Millionaire Playboys, and Two Hoots and a Holler. He went solo with his album Bandura in 1996. He subsequently signed with Sony and released Life of the Party on Sony's subsidiary Lucky Dog Records. The album gave him three of his biggest hits, including My Hometown. His next release was a live disc called Unleashed Live, which is credited to Charlie, brother Bruce, and Jack Ingram. He then signed with Columbia Records for Step Right Up and another live album. American Christian rock singer, known for his work with his band Myland and Broken Heart. He is a Gospel Music Hall of Fame inductee who traveled around the United States ministering, teaching, and singing. He sometimes could be seen on television networks such as TBN, Daystar, and Victory Channel. Born on October 6, 1944, in Gulfport, Mississippi, into the pioneering Southern Gospel family, the Lefevers, Mylon was the youngest son of Eva Mai and Urias Lefever. When he was old enough, he began to sing and play guitar with the group. American musician and composer best known for his 1976 hit songs Dream Weaver and Love is Alive. Wright's breakthrough album, The Dream Weaver 1975, came after he had spent seven years in London as, alternately, a member of the British blues rock band Spooky Tooth and a solo artist on a M Records. While in England, he played keyboards on former Beatle George Harrison's triple album. All Things Must Pass on Teen 70, so beginning a friendship that inspired the Indian religious themes and spirituality inherent in Wright's subsequent songwriting. American writer, musician, and marketing executive, best known as the other guitarist in Dire Straits during the band's Brothers in Arms era. John Thomas Sonny was born on December 9, 1954, in Indiana, Pennsylvania. He was drawn to music at an early age, first learning piano, then trumpet, before taking up guitar at 14. His love of the instrument led him to leave the University of Connecticut, where he was studying literature, to attend the Hartford Conservatory of Music. After graduating, Sonny was introduced to New York session guitarist Elliot Randall, who had played the solo on Steely Dan's single Reelands in the years. Sixto Diaz Rodriguez, mononymously known as Rodriguez, was an American musician from Detroit, Michigan. Though his career was initially met with little fanfare in the United States, he found success in South Africa, Australia touring the country twice in his earlier career, and New Zealand. Unbeknownst to him for decades, his music was extremely successful and influential in South Africa, where he is believed to have sold more records than Elvis Presley as well as other countries in Southern Africa. Information about him was scarce, and it was incorrectly rumored there that he had died by suicide shortly after releasing his second album. English rock and blues guitarist. He is primarily known for his work with Whitesnake, having written or co-written with David Coverdale many of the group's hit songs, such as Fool for Your Loving, Walking in the Shadow of the Blues, Ready and Willing, Love Hunter, Trouble. And here I go again. After playing with local Buckingham-based groups, including Clockwork Mousestrap, previously the Daystroms, Marsden formed Skinny Cat at the age of 17. Marsden got his first professional gig with UFO in 1972. He next played with Glenn Cornick's Wild Turkey in 1973, before he joined drummer Cozy Powell's band Cozy Powell's Hammer. Jusumon Seri, a rapper protege of Germain Dupri, has died, according to his publicist. 
He was 35, no cause of death was given. Capone Rodriguez Smith had been missing from Chicago since July. It is unclear if he surfaced before his death or why he went missing. He also was known to fans as Dope Boy Ra and Rara. Tapone gained prominence during the mid-2000s performing in the underground hip-hop scene in Atlanta, according to XXL, that's with a heavy, heavy heart that I'm even posting this. We made magic when we strategically put out our projects always, he wrote. Young Capone, Akai Dopo Boy Ra, Oka Rara, was one of my first hip hoof. Fotemi Cairo was born 28 April 2002, was an English singer and songwriter. The musician from Sunderland performed on BBC Music Introducing in 2022. She won the 2021 Lindisfarne's Allen Hull Award. Fantero was twice diagnosed with leukaemia as a child and found out in August 2022 she had a rare and aggressive brain tumor. She died today at age of 21. Irish Grindstead was an American singer who rose to fame as a member of the R.B. Girl, Group 702, along with her sister Lemisha and Orish Grindstead. She was known for her vocal contributions to songs such as Stilo, Where My Girl's At, and I Still Love You. She passed away today at the age of 43 after a long battle with kidney failure. a British singer, songwriter, and musician. His music is an eclectic mix of folk music and popular songs, the latter variously in a crooning or in a schlager style. He is best known for his baritone singing voice and trademark whistling ability, as well as his guitar skills. The Times observed that SOM pop singers define the zeitgeist and many more follow it. A much rarer number of them defy it, and Roger Whittaker counted himself proudly and unapologetically among them, despite not having sustained chart success. He gained a large international following through TV appearances and live performances with fan clubs in at least 12 countries including Australia, Canada, Great Britain, New Zealand, South Africa, and the United States.